back to my channel so today i've got a bit of a different video i think i've ever done a video like this on my channel before so today i'm going to be sharing with you guys some of the things that i think you need not just you i need them as well because i haven't got some of these stuff just things that you need to spice up your wardrobe like these are all things that i really want to get with time my bank account is not unlimited so obviously i cannot get them all at once otherwise i would have done that by now so yeah i want to share with you guys the things that i think are really cool things that are a bit out there and i will try and leave links for the items a lot of the items are picked just from Pinterest and I couldn't find links so I'll find either dupes or things that look like them I will link them all in the description so you guys can see them the order of the things I'm showing you are so random so sorry about that but I kind of made this just over a period of time so yeah okay the very first thing which I know everyone's gonna have an opinion about is cowboy boots I initially hated them didn't think they were very like an easy fashion thing to work with don't know why I just that was my initial view. But with time, I've actually grown to really like cowboy boots. I haven't got a pair yet myself. I really do want to get them. But the reason why I fell in love with them, really random. So I'll try and find a picture to put up here, but I was trying to find one earlier on. I really struggled to. If you've ever watched Marion at First Sight Australia, the latest season, I think it's season nine or eight. I can't remember exactly which one. There's a person called Sam. She wore cowboy boots with her outfit. And I don't know what it was. I loved it. Every outfit she wore where she wore cowboy boots, I thought it was so cool. From watching that after that, it just really grew on me. I watched a lot of videos, like to see how you could style them. And now I'm like, you know what? Maybe I could pull it off. That is the first piece that I just think is, well, I know it's controversial, but for whatever reason, it's just grown on me. It's such a cool way to spice up your wardrobe. The second thing, right, I'm not gonna lie. This is a very generic, basic thing. Like everyone probably already owns one of these. Everyone went through a period of getting this. I'm a bit late to that trend. So the second thing is the Vivian Westwood necklaces. Well, I feel like all of their necklaces this just kind of went viral but the ones that were kind of big were the pearl i can't say it the pearl the pearl necklaces okay i'll put a picture up here of the exact one i'm talking about because this one is a lot more out there than the kind of gen not generic but like the kind of single bead ones i don't know what it is i really like the chunky ones i just think it's so nice to have a statement necklace that you can wear with pretty much every outfit there's also other necklaces that are gorgeous rather than vivian westwood ones but that's just the one that i personally think would spice up my wardrobe the next thing i feel like i spoke about in my last video and it's a very particular thing that I just personally want and I think make my wardrobe look a bit extra. The brand's called Sabono. I'll link them down below. So they have a bag. I think it's called the Vienna bag, I want to say. I really like the design of it. I feel like the design is so unique. I've not seen a bag like that before, which is why I really, really liked it. Oh my god, my voice is so croaky. What is going on? Yeah, I just like how minimal it is, but it still looks cute and a bit different to a typical kind of bag it's got an option where you can wear it across the body and also like have it it's like a little bag to just hold like that why does my hair look so weird like that what? don't know what it is about that bag but I, ever since i saw it, i've just been obsessed with it right the next thing is very basic i guess again it is a black hairband and i know very very basic but for example right so you've got like a knitted dress you got those tights on some nice boots on i just feel like it's an easy way to spice up an outfit so yeah i actually bought a black hairband recently me because my other one got lost and i'm gonna i'm gonna be wearing that non-stop in autumn i can wear it now but i don't know what it, does anyone else do that i just generalize certain like accessories and clothes with certain seasons there's no like rule saying that but in my head that's what you wear in autumn i don't know why it's weird another thing that i think is really really cute is tote bags they are very basic you can get so many different designed ones and if you're someone who's very minimalist likes to wear very like you don't want to go too out there but you want to look cute i just Look, like it's such an easy way to spruce up what you're wearing. The next thing I have is a gold metal outline claw clip. The easiest way to show you is I'll put some pictures, but there's so many different designed ones, and obviously you can just get the plastic ones, and they're also really cute. I just see them as very like classic, classical, class classy. I literally can't speak today. Oh my god! And they're really easy to add into any outfit you wear. Like the one that I would really like is the butterfly one. I'll put a picture up here, but that one is just so cute. And if you know me, I love butterflies. Just something different, a bit extra as well so yeah now the next one i titled literally chunky stuff that sounds really weird i'm gonna go into detail with that so the first thing i think that looks cute is chunky belts and i feel like if especially in like winter or like when you're wearing a dress and it's like a bit boxy if you add a little belt i just feel like not only is it snatching your waist but it's just adding a little extra a little extra spice you know then i also think like chunky jewelry can be so cute so for a chunky ring i think this one could look so cute and then if you add like other little dainty rings it will look quite nice then like a chunky bracelet i really wanted this bangle stuff like that it just adds a bit 
bit of something it's a bit different like it will draw a bit of attention there's just so many ways you can spice it up especially if you have an outfit already put you just want to add a bit extra i mean i'm literally telling you how to spice up your wardrobe when i'm actually wearing a basic dress and very basic jewelry but this is my thing i'm gonna be i'm making an effort i want to spice up my wardrobe so you better subscribe and wait and see that content to come so the next thing that i think is so cool is cropped waistcoats i think they would look so nice with a shirt like wearing a shirt dress and then wearing it over the top i think it would look really really nice those waistcoats that you can get like black leather ones they look so so cool so i really want to buy one this year and add that to my wardrobe now this when i next get paid when i next have money i am getting this outfit I feel like it's a sign. I saw this outfit on a girl that I follow. Her name's Allison. She has a YouTube channel and she's really nice. And she posts so many nice like fashion pics and stuff and all that. I saw her post a picture wearing something similar. And then on TikTok, I saw somebody post a video wearing this outfit. So, but this flared like, is it a rib material? I don't like lettuce cut ribs kind of shiny like it looks so cute it really does give me abba vibes for whatever reason there's so many different colors but yeah if you got that like that literally is your whole wardrobe spice stuff this is gonna be another controversial one and i'm still a bit on the fence because there's only been a handful of times where i've seen people wearing this and i thought it was cute the next one is knee-high socks i've seen some outfits where it looks so cute and so nice seen others where like i've just not been a fan of it I'm not sure if I would suit it. I, I'm very sure. I feel like I could look like a school kid. Some girls I've seen really look cute in it. There's one picture I'm going to include here, but I personally am not a fan of the shoes in the picture. So once again, I've not been able to find a picture that really just sums up what I mean when I'm talking about it. But I feel like with a tennis skirt, a nice jumper, cute knee high socks could look really, really nice. I've not found a picture to be able to show you guys what I mean. So I don't know if you're going to watch this and be like, what are you talking about it doesn't look cute the next thing is kind of generic i guess i feel like that one is a bit more of like a staple thing which is quite good because it means you could rewear it loads and you could wear it with so many different outfits so the next thing is knee-high boots the ones that i really liked i couldn't find a link or a picture i'm going to have a look again after this video but they're basically a dupe of the steve madden ones so i'll include a picture of the steve madden ones here they weren't as thick and as high heeled as those ones were but for me like i said i'm five foot those would be perfect because that would actually get me to an normal height they really can make an outfit go from not looking basic but from looking like yeah i guess basic just to making it look a bit extra final thing is a bit random don't know what people are gonna think about this so i always get ads now don't know why but i always get ads for a side i've never personally ordered anything from there but i've seen like videos of other people doing hauls and stuff their stuff looks really really cute at some point i think i will do a haul the dresses from Cider are insane. They are so stunning. They have so many different like types of dresses, long ones, short ones, like the designs are so gorgeous. If you're looking for some dresses or just something to kind of be a bit extra with, I feel like that is a good place to go and have a look. That is everything that I've kind of collected i've basically found over the last few months so yeah i don't know if you guys will agree with me or if you think some of these items are a bit basic a bit random they probably are but that's just my personal opinion on what i think could spice up i don't know about your wardrobe but they could spice up my wardrobe that's for sure so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this please make sure to like and subscribe because that all really helps my channel and i will see you guys in my next video